Hello everyone, my name is Danny from creatingawebstore.com and in today's tutorial I would like to go over how to access your Plex control panel. I basically have a virtual private server set up uh, for demonstration purposes. Uh, I will be installing some uh, software on it and uh, figured I'd uh, shoot some video tutorials and while I'm at it, why not show people how to use Plesk. Uh, if you have a dedicated server set up, you can uh, use uh, this tutorial for your dedicated server as well. Now, um, as you can see, I'm here in my GoDaddy control panel. If you're using a different host, uh, all you really need to get is your IP address. In some cases, they even email you the IP address. And once you have that ready, just uh, copy it and go to your address bar and paste it there and type colon 8443 and hit enter and you will automatically be taken to your uh, Plast control panel now once you are here you will need uh, to enter in your username and password with some hosts uh, you set up your username and password uh, while um, checking out uh, with others, uh, they email you this information. Uh, with GoDaddy, for example, uh, the username is admin, and whatever uh, the password uh, you chose for your VPS or dedicated server is what you enter in the password field. And then once you uh, enter in that information, you will be taken uh, to this screen here where you will be asked for uh, the administrator information you basically enter in this information and then hit OK and you will be taken to the Plast control panel which is where you can set up DNS, email, um, your website, uh, multiple sites on there and a ton of other stuff so uh, if you want to see more uh, just uh, check out my other videos on how to use Plesk. Thank you for watching and uh, while you're at it why not visit creatingawebstore.com